Hello everyone and welcome back to the Fat Hipster channel. Now before I begin today, I'm going to start off by asking you to please subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. Now moving on, where are we today? Today, we're at none other than across the head here, KFC. We have some KFC fries here. Um, let's see. Do any of the boxes have their symbol? Oh, the cups do. Thank you, fried chicken. KFC. It's finger looking good. And the catchphrases. Anyway, today I'm going to be trying a new sauce that just came out for customers of the restaurant KFC. And today I'm going to be tasting that sauce. Um, this was the. Uh, what I ordered was called the Tinder Tender Meal. This is a sponsored uh, combo that KFC is working alongside of the Tinder application. Uh, you don't need to have a Tinder account or the app to use this. It's just automatically in their menu when you go to your mobile app, uh, for KFC mobile app, or to their website to order. I do not believe you can just walk in and order this. I think it is a mobile device or online uh, special. Anyway, that meal comes with two three tender pieces, so six totals. Two fries, or you can exchange those for other sides if you want, and two beverages. Well, since this is not a a, a date besides the date between you and I here uh, that we're meeting together for this occasion. Um, I ordered this for myself. Uh, I got it for eyes and I got some macaroni which I already ate. But um, a few things before I start this. The sauce that I'm going to be reviewing is this Buffalo Ranch. They already had buffalo, they already had ranch. Now they have Buffalo Ranch. But uh, this meal is supposed to come with three sauces, and I chose Buffalo Ranch for all three of my sauces. However, I was given two classic ranches instead. Well, thank goodness they gave me one of these, so at least I can be able to taste it and believe I like it. Is it, are you like rationing these out? Like every order can only get one now? Because that should be something that you put online when people are ordering. And why give me two ranches? Like if you're running out of buffalo ranch, why don't you give me a ranch and a buffalo? Then I can make my own buffalo ranch. Anyway, two ranches that uh, probably just gonna go in my sauce bin in the freezer that has all my extra sauce packets. But anyway, we're gonna try this buffalo ranch after I complain about one more thing. Like I said, this came with two beverages. Here are my two beverages. I thought, you know, I know that last time I went to KFC and asked if they would mix a sweet tea and a lemonade together, they said they wouldn't do it. But if I order a lemonade and a sweet tea, I can mix to my heart's content. So that's what I decided to do. I ordered lemonade, but they also have strawberry lemonade. So I was like, interesting, I never had a strawberry lemonade mixed with sweet tea. Let's try it out. So I got a strawberry lemonade and a sweet tea. What I got was a dark drink and another dark drink. When I tasted them, both, they both taste like the same thing, like a raspberry sweet tea. When I ordered this online, it didn't say raspberry sweet tea, it just said sweet tea. So what am I expecting to get is just black tea that's been sweetened perhaps with a slight lemony flavor, um, but at least just a sweet tea. It tastes like tea with sugar in it, and that what I got. I got two raspberry flavoring sweet teas um, and zero strawberry lemonade. So neither of the drinks that I wanted was the drinks that I got. And the whole reason I ordered for the Buffalo Ranches which supposed to get three, only got one. 
So KFC, you have failed me. Let's go ahead and continue on and open this up and taste it. I imagine it's going to taste like Buffalo Ranch. John, why do you do this review if you're just going to complain and say that it's not anything special? I thought you only reviewed the special things. Special enough. It's got that classic buffalo orange flavor. It smells a little bit ranchy, but also some cayenne to it. Let's give it a taste. It's really buffalo y. Another bite. Right. So, if you didn't know what buffalo sauce is, it's essentially you take a hot sauce, which is typically a brighter red color and you mix it with melted butter and those combine to make a buffalo sauce and this actually just tastes like buffalo sauce um, you can see like herby bits in there But there's just no, there's no ranchiness to it. Maybe the ranch is just bad. They gave me it. Might as well try it. the uh, KFC ranch sauce to just see like maybe they just have a inferior ranch flavor to begin with. Not the best ranch I've ever had, but it tastes like ranch. It's no hidden valley. But you know, it's not really strong or intensely ranchy sauce. So even though I can taste it, if I dip that back in on the ranch and the ranch buffalo together. You can actually taste the ranch that way. Hmm. KFC, I think we're just full of disappointment today because you messed up the order. You didn't give me the sauces or the drinks that I asked for. Oh, I also asked for a plate because when you're ordering it, they're like, do you want a plate with napkins and forks and knives? I say, yes, please give me a plate. Then you give me a plate. Um, so... The service was disappointing, but also the product was disappointing. Um, so if you saw ads, commercials for the new Buffalo Ranch sauce at KFC, and you considered going because that's something that sounds good to you, uh, don't. It's disappointing. There's really no ranch flavor in the Buffalo Ranch. It just tastes like buffalo sauce. Um, that they put a little specks in it to make it look like it had ranch in it, but it actually doesn't. 
So that's it. Um, this video is giving a thumbs down for those uh, products and services. I will not be going back to KFC to order this again. KFC in the future. When you come out with a new sauce. Make sure it tastes like what you're saying it's going to taste like. I do have an idea for you. Um, that hopefully will be coming up in a video soon. Um, there's a video that I've been planning to make for over a year now. Uh, due to a few reasons, mostly the lack of participants that I was hoping to get for it. But um, it'll come out and it'll just be me. I'll just be tasting a bunch of sauces and let you know which one is the best. And at that point, I will tell KFC they should use the sauce as a limited time sauce for themselves in the Chicagoland area. And that might be a great partnership for them as well. But anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. That's the end of it. I already told you what to do at the beginning, so I don't have to repeat that again. All I will say, though, is goodbye.